Wellman Education. Welcome dear learners. Today you are going to know about the statistics. And under statistics, today you are going to know about mean. Mean of ungrouped data. So here is question number one. The following are the ages in years of 11 students in a school football team 15 17 14 13 16 18 16 17 15 13 14 find the mean age of these students here the solution comes The sum of the ages in years of all the 11 students equals to 15 plus 17 plus 14 plus 13 plus 16 plus 15 plus 16 plus 17 plus 15 plus 13 plus 14 if you take them together then you will get 165 you must work out on your own to come to this conclusion of 165 your sum total therefore mean age equals to sum of ages of all students divided by total number of students so what is the sum of the total number of students that is 165 how many students are there 11 so when you divide it then you will get 15 years Question number two, find the mean of first nine prime numbers. So you have to know first five nine prime numbers. Many students do not know the odd number and the even number. So here is prime number. So you must know it. Here is the solution. First nine prime numbers are, first one is two then 3, then 5, then 7, then 11, then 13, then 17, then 19, then 23. So now we are taking the sum of these prime numbers 2 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 11 plus 13 plus 17 plus 19 plus 23 so total comes 100 so their mean equals to sum of numbers that is 100 by that is divided by number of numbers how many numbers are there nine so when we divide 100 by 9 we get 11 1 by 9 it is a mixed fraction again when you want to divide it in decimals then you will get 11.11 so all this you can work out on your own just to increase your confidence of working out the sums in the exam hall question number three the mean of seven observations is 18.5. If six of them are 14, 23, 25, 13, 17 and 15, find the seventh observation. 
so here you have to understand the language of mathematics once you know the language of mathematics you understand the language of mathematics your half the work is done now the solution comes let the seventh observation be x that means we are using algebraic method over here therefore mean equals to sum of all observations divided by number of observations so here we put in the simple equation format we have put here we have already got 18.5 and 13 plus 14 plus 15 plus 17 plus 23 plus 25 plus x divided by 7 so what we get 18.5 equals to 107 plus x divided by 7 so here we brought the x plus 107 this side and cross multiplication 18.5 into 7 then we got 129 by multiplying 18.5 into 7 we got 129.5 and then this 107 is on the left hand side we have to take it on the right hand side as the simple equation says so here x equals to 107 taken that side on the right hand side from the left hand side so a minus so 129 minus 129.5 minus 107 so therefore we get x equals to 22.5 this is a very interesting sum you must work out on your own number four sum follows the following are the weights in kg of six students of a class 55 45 47 49 50.5 53.5 find their mean weight number one and if a parent whose weight is 64 kg is included then what will be the mean weight so here is a two question asked so let the solution come here is the solution the sum of weights of six students 55 plus 45 plus 47 plus 49 plus 50.5 plus 53.5 students remember that over here your knowledge of decimal is also being tested okay not nothing to be panicky so here this is very interesting sum in the sense that if you do not know about decimal then you won't be able to do anything okay so you have to learn the decimal i have a earlier video there is a decimal chapter decimal video you can go through it so here mean weight equals to sum of weights of all students divided by number of students so our sum of the weights was 300 divided by 6 so 50 kg okay so that was their mean weight now our parent is included with weight of 64 kg so increased weight equals to 300 plus 64 that is equals to 364 and there are six members already students and one that is parent so six plus one seven increased number remember therefore mean weight 364 divided by seven when you divide it then you will get 52 kg so mean weight of this seven part seven okay including the parents is 52 thanks for watching i will tell you something that please subscribe the channel and share it because many students are not getting the benefit of this channel so you please share among yourselves as the students can get 
maximum benefit out of it. It is a free channel.